What's going on everybody? This is Brian from SneakerFiles.com and today we're showing you a closer look at the Air Jordan 10 Los Angeles, a part of the City Collection. These are going to drop this Saturday, May 14, 2016. Retail price is $190 and you will be able to cop these at Chic Shoes Retailers. I'll have a link down in the description where you can find the nearest retailer. Okay, now bringing you a bit closer, um, one of the things in the image is that, um, you know, it doesn't really show but in person you will see more is the uppers which are synthetic they have a cracked like finish to it almost makes them look tarnished or burnished or whatever you want to call it um, I'm not even sure if it's gonna pick up right on camera but if you're copying these definitely you'll be able to notice in person Now there's a mixture of ocean fog which is basically a shade of blue and midnight navy through the uppers and for those that do not know the inspiration behind this is from the Los Angeles Dodgers. So that's what I've been told and what kind of leaked early on. And the midsole is not really a true white. Um, it's very close, but it's more of an off-white. So there's that. And um, one of the odd things, I'll show you one second, is on the eye stays, though. It's actually a, almost a corduroy like material. It's, I'm not a, really a fan of that, but to each its own, I guess. And the tongue, the bottom half is a very, it's almost, it's almost like a wool, very thick. It's all knitted. And then again, you have a bit more of that corduroy like material. And the top of the tongue, again, you have that. It's more smooth, but it's <clears throat> than the sides because, like, in areas you can almost feel that cracked um, look, but on the tongue you really can't. You got LA stitched right by the collar instead of the 23 or 45. Same deal around the heel. It's that corduroy like material. I'm not quite sure what it is, but it's like corduroy. So, if I could be wrong on that, and I apologize, but getting them in hand, you'll definitely notice. Now, the liner is um, done in Blue Lagoon, so it's a bit more bright. And same with the insole. Sorry if you can't see that, but... And then the inside of the tongue... Air Jordan and it says City Collection. Now to the sole. Got I believe that is Midnight Navy. And then we have your Blue Lagoon and that I'm just gonna call it white, but it's more of an off-white. It's not I don't know. I don't I wouldn't necessarily say it's an off-white, but it's not like your true white. Not that it makes a difference if you like these. Um Definitely, you know, it's just some of the images made online made them look like it was like a pure white. I think the official images by Nike did, but uh, in hand, it's a bit different. Um, to be honest, I really did like like these, and I like the images of them better than having them in hand. But personal opinion, I'm not a fan of this corduroy type deal. Not a fan of this cracked look. Um, very more standout-ish in person, but to each so.
right, guys, we hope you enjoyed this detailed and on feet look at the Air Jordan 10 LA, aka Los Angeles, a part of the City Pack. Just to recap, though, they dropped this Saturday, May 14, 2016. Retail will be $190. Um, I don't, you know, I don't know. I don't think there's too much hype behind this, to be honest with you. I know the Chicago pair, I don't want to say it's limited, but I checked in with my local store and they said they haven't received them yet. And it doesn't look like they're gonna get them. So there's that. And uh, the LA, I'm in California, so it makes sense that the retailers will have them here. I know a lot of these aren't really like a regional type release, but uh, yeah, they're, I'm not really too sure about the Chicago's. Like, I think it's a, I don't wanna say it's limited, but it's on the side of it. It's kind of like leaning towards that way. But uh, I haven't, honestly, I haven't checked like the Foot Locker, the, re the locators and things like that. So um, don't take my word for it. Uh, but in any case, we will update sneakerfiles.com. And if that, you know, is the case. But uh, yeah, let us know what you think of these. If you plan on picking them up or not. Overall, um, I'd say I'm a little bit disappointed. Like, I, I don't know. I'm just disappointed. I was really amped about this shoe. Maybe the Hornets one will revived it for me but uh like the quality isn't terrible it's just i don't like the corduroy look and i don't like the like that cracked tarnished look through the base and it stands out a bit more it looks like it's pretty scratched up but it's really not it's, it's the look of the shoe so um and uh if you've watched this far uh we are going to do the giveaway very very soon it's going to be the flu games Debating on doing two because we're gonna partner up with somebody on one of the giveaways and um, uh, We're working out the details on that. So we might do a second one Pretty positive. We're gonna do a second one which will be a little bit easier because the, the first one's gonna be kind of like a An Instagram type deal. You still got to be subscribed But it's gonna be like a dual type thing and then the second giveaway will just be subscribed so Again, thanks for watching. Stay tuned to sneakerfiles.com, and if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe.